Welcome back guys. So in this video I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna replace my Thunderbolt cable. My Thunderbolt cable on my cinema display. So I'm talking about this guy right there. And I'm replacing it because whoa. I don't know if you guys can see that, but yep, right there, you guys can see, it's cracked. So, I got this cable on eBay. It's supposed to be a brand new one. Um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it's not. I guess uh, I'm gonna find out. <laughs> so, um, So let me first set you up so you guys can see and uh, let's do this. Okay guys, so first thing that we need to do in, is to remove this glass. So this glass, it's held by magnets all the way around. So that's what we need to do. Just get a, like a small pair tool and basically work your way around or Probably you can be able to get it with your fingers and pry it out. Just be careful. Slowly just go around. Boom. After removing the glass, then we have some screws all the way around. Let's see. Whoa. There you go. So this is so this is a T10. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16 screws So there you guys have it So I hope you guys can see that so this guy right here came from right here and Then this guy came from here These two guys came from here and here so you lift up the bottom, you disconnect this guy first, you disconnect then the second guy. Uh, after that, right here, it's this plug. So you grab it from the bottom, you squeeze it and you pull it out. Then right here, it's your ground looks like it. You need to unscrew it, pull it out. And basically, that's about it. This is your entire display. And the screws basically looks like we need to undo only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve screws. That's it. You guys don't need to undo the ones on the bottom. Just so you know. Okay. Okay guys, so here where the fun part. So this is the Replacement cable that we need to put in. So I don't know if you guys can see that. But basically, this guy is right here. This cable goes under and round and connects to this board. This guy right there goes through here and connects right here. So, we need to unscrew this board, this cap right there, and then we need to get this board upside down to be able to get to be able to get access to this cable, so we can get it unplugged as well. So actually, I'm thinking 
first we need to get this cable unplugged so again that's a T10 okay so there is a, a bunch of capacitors on the bottom so I'm gonna unplug this power cord which grab it from the bottom and there you have it looks like this is like a standard mall legs I think you call it that's a 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 10 um, I don't know if I need to remove all of that since I'm flipping it. Let's see. Yeah. So I don't know if you guys can see. This is basically the back of the display. And you have all the USBs, uh, Thunderbolt and the Wi-Fi, I mean not the Wi-Fi but the internet and this is where the actual monitor plugs in right here so basically this is like the motherboard looks like it in my understanding so this is how we're gonna do it we don't want to create any short if we can I don't know so I'm gonna grab this rag right here put it on top and then now when you flip it have a surface where nothing is conductive on the bottom of it and then these guys here looks like they're small these two guys are T6 should be able just to there we go, yeah slide it out boom Okay, so you got this cable out. Now I'm gonna flip it back and put it in place again. Okay, now I'm gonna cover this section. And we're gonna roll back to this side. So, Coming over here, we have a tape, so this tape is going to come out just like that. Boom, boom, and this guy's out. Then coming out is this guy right there. So push it down and out, and there you have it. This guy's out, this tape here. Take tape out and about right there. Okay, we have another tape over here, it looks like it. That's gonna break. No. Here's what it is. Then we have a ground. And then this guy right there, we have another tape. There you go. So now Okay, doki. And boom. Okay. Now this cable almost out there you go as you guys can see how it came loose it's kind of like underneath this guy right there so boom now here comes the easy part Just slide it out and voila we have the old cable out now we're grabbing the new one. There you have it. 
and then this is just a cover this is a charger for your laptop and boom now slide, slide this guy underneath this metal pin right there push it all the way so it actually seals the back and now in reverse slide this tape with this guy right there slide it over there Put the tape like that. Get this guy underneath. Okay. Come on, come on. I'll have all day. And then, boom, click it. Okay. I'll get them all together. And uh, type of a deal. And then. Boom! Looks like that part is kind of done. Then this tape over here, put it on the top. Pushy, pushy, squeezy, squeezy, you know, all the good stuff. Then don't forget to put the bracket right in there. Come on now. There we go. So actually the bracket goes underneath this metal piece. So this piece is actually on the very top. And now this one, it's uh, very small threads. So this guy goes in there. That's the only guy that's different from the other two. I'll show you. Whoop. Don't forget the ground. Jesus. Come on. There you go. And these guys, you guys see how the threads are not that thin, I guess. So these guys are going right here. Boom, get this guy tight, get this guy tight, and get the ground tight. Okay, looks like that it's pretty tight, it's uh, kind of done. Now, let's get this cable kind of set up in place, push it down. Now this tape goes on the top, just like that, and again, pushy pushy, slidey slidey, there we have it, then let's put the rack on the top, flip the board, there we go. Now this guy is, this guy is going to slide, boom, directly into his spot, let's put the cover back, let's put this screw back, and put the other screw back, again, this is T6, Get it hand tight. Doesn't need to fly. And boom. Now, looks like this guy was supposed to be there somehow. Check all of your connections here. So there is no surprises. 
perfect put it back into place once again hand tight now I can plug this guy back in boom Okay guys, so let's put the display in place. There we go. Hope you guys can see that. So First, let's put the ground, which is this guy right there. This one is kind of tricky, but hey. Take your time. Okay. Now, this guy or either this guy doesn't really matter whatever you guys prefer so this guy's gonna go right in there right in there then I guess I can plug this guy right in here there you go now this okay Hoping that you guys can be able to see it, but I don't know. Just so make sure you take your time. Stuff like that doesn't happen. So what I'm saying, you should take your time. Hope you guys can see that. This pushed all the way in. And looks like the sign needs to face down. Okay, now this tape here is gonna tape these guys. Okay, now before we close it, I'm gonna plug, I'm gonna plug my laptop just to make sure that everything is running. So, got my laptop. So basically, gonna take this cap out. Now I'm gonna plug it in to the Thunderbolt. Boom! It's working. Look at that. So now we need to put all the screws back. Let's 
make sure it's all the way good. All the way around. And boom. Okay guys, well, we replaced the cable. Everything is good to go, everything is working. Make sure that between the front glass and the actual screen, everything is clean. There is no dust, no hair, no nothing. Because probably it's gonna bug you. Or at least for me, it's gonna bug me. So, thank you so much for watching. I hope you like this video. So don't forget to hit the like button, destroy the like button, smash the like button. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribers. And if you guys want to see more videos like that, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you on the next one.